Hi, in this session we'll see how to add the field validation in a table control. So as field validation we already seen in the previous session in the, on the screen level. So as in previous session we have designed a table control. So we'll see again the same how to add the field validation in the table control. So as we have created this table control for the family members of an employee master. So what validation we'll add here? Suppose in case user has selected any value from the relationship okay and if he's not entering name or data bird and without entering the name of data bird if he's coming back then we'll give the error message okay if he's not selected if this is blank and he's coming back we not give any error message so we'll see how to implement the field validation table control so in sc38 go to our program Go to our screen number 200. Now, when we will design the table control using wizard. Automatically, in the PAI module, in the loop and loop, the system has designed the chain and chain processing. So, what we will do in the chain and chain, we will add our validation here. Before this, this is standard one by default created by system. TC1 to modify. Before that, we will add our validation model here. <coughs> Double click here. As I, already I have already created this in my program. So, when you are doing first time, system will ask you whether you want to create. You just click on yes. So, I am adding my validation like this. When the psi ecom is back or exit or cancel and if the relationship field is not initial okay then process this block if the name is initial give the error message enter name and if the data bird is initial enter the, uh, give the error message as enter data bird okay if relationship is not initial and name is there and data is there then system will not give any error message so what we have done On our screen in the process of the input model in this chain and chain processing I added new validation here and in this we have written our logic and we have added condition like if user press on psi ecom if if you just normal pressing enter on the table control system will not do any validation we have put validation only your back exit and cancel button now let's test this execute enter the employee id click here add one row don't select any value come back system has not given any error message again click here select the values now go back now we can see error message enter the name press enter again go back again system is giving error message enter data bird put some data bird here now come back there is no error message so in this way we can uh, we can add the validation at table control level we have already seen and the screen level in detail concept okay so here in short i have shown you how to implement the same field level validation for a table control where we are done in our screen PAA module this is by default created when you have created table control using wizard in n chain chain we have done here so in this way we have seen how to do the field validation in table control thank you